memories are forever. Hello, I'm Melissa and today we are shipping my eBay packages that sold within the last 24 hours. It is September 8th and I'm wearing my wrapping is my happy place shirt I got for $3.99. It's from It Works, but it works. <laughs> it's very soft. Let's log into eBay. I used my vacation store settings to turn off my store last week while I was doing a few things. And then I was like, oh, I should turn it back on for a day because I have some time. And then 15 items sold. So then I just turned it back off. <laughs> my mom and sister and niece and brother-in-law are coming, not here, but to stay at my friend's condo and they will be arriving tomorrow for my mom's 60th birthday. Thank you so much if you sent a card. I've got a big stack of cards for her. She doesn't know. I don't think she knows. So I pulled the items. These are all of them, like almost $300 worth of items. And I have all of the fun things. So I will zoom you in on this space so you can see me wrap and see what I have. And we'll get going. The first item is this Lily Sudoku. That's clearly not what that says. And it's a necklace. All of these items, all of them were from Thread Up. Ooh, let's let's quickly check Thread Up. Okay. I check Thread Up like 4,000 times a day. We're all checking Thread Up to see if they have mystery boxes. They don't have them, but like once a month and they sell out immediately. They don't have them. Dart it. I don't need extras, but it'd be good to have backup backup. So it is a silver tone circle on a silver tone chain. And this one was brand new. I think this was one of the ones that Pop Sugar or FabFitFun sent out. And it probably retailed for like $50, but they only bring about $5. Did this one bring $5? $4.99 with $3.99 shipping. So I don't necessarily have to put it in a box because all my boxes are too small. But, but one of my viewers sent me these and they're blue. So I think I'm gonna cut this open. I've been using these, but I still have a stack. So thank you so much to the subscriber that sent these. put it around to give it a little bit of protection and let's use the treat yourself sticker I got off Amazon we have Mary scissors still using those of course and let's pick one of these oh, the hearts are cute too okay we'll go with the jewels we have jewel tissue paper this was sent in by somebody as well, and I don't know where they got it. It does feel more like, like a recycled tissue paper, I'm gonna say, which is very nice. Just take my fingers to do that. I have dropped my cup, you were gonna crack up, in the last two days, five times. Five times my hand has just absolutely let go and dropped my cup. I'm so glad it didn't crack. I dropped a fork today too. I'm just dropping things all over the place here. Fold it over nicely. Get out of our way. There we are. My husband is a musician and he is at a friend's recording studio putting together a song. I forget which song I should know. I listened to it yesterday. He's got several friends with recording studios here. There's a lot of really good musicians here in Florida in our area. And he was filling up to going, so we weren't sure about that, but he's doing well enough. He is waiting on a surgery that needs to happen in the next three weeks, and he's at the top of the cancellation list, so it's just an outpatient, nothing surgery. But he was filling up to going today. And I think you're recording harmonies today. So there we go, it says greetings. Look how pretty that is. And I have several, I mean, I have all of the ribbons. I have this blue gingham. 
I think somebody used this. This doesn't have a ton of blue though. We have green leaves and we have light blue. It's like a chiffon sheer fabric. So we will go with this one. Oh, you know what? I have pinking shears. <laughs> I'm so fancy. Barb from Barbie Girl Thrifter on YouTube sent me these. I adore her. Barb, if you're watching, I adore you. She's just so sweet and nice and lovely. And her videos don't get enough views and I don't know why. It's really hard, I think, when you're starting YouTube. Some people hit, you know, like a million views really quickly and just go viral. And it took me, I don't know, like three years to get to the point I am. I don't really watch my, my subscriber count. In fact, I don't know if I even know how many thousand I have. Thousands, I have thousands of subscribers. I have no idea. Uh, where do I find that? Oh, 13.9, I'm about to hit 14,000 subscribers. That's nice. Happy 14,000 subscribers, me. We have some business cards. We'll do my business cards first. It says, you are enough. You are so enough. It is unbelievable how enough you are. And then I have these made at Vistaprint. I think they cost about three or four cents a piece. They're pretty thick and they have a really nice raised texture. They say you are beautiful, capable, and worthy. And then I didn't put anything on the back of that and I rounded the edges. Will that focus? I don't know if that's going to focus better than that. But this part, you probably can't see it, but it's raised. It's really pretty. So I'll put those on. And I have sheet masks. We will do the pearl. Oh, I have new sheet masks next video. <laughs> I found new sheet masks on Amazon that were the same price actually. These are 38 cents I think. They were 100 for 39.99 so they were ever so slightly more but I've been using these for so long I'm like let's see if we could find something new. Nobody cares that it has different packaging but but I wanted to find something new. So that's this. We will slip it into the rose gold mailer. Look how pretty that is. Oh, it's so good. Oh my goodness, it's so good. Okay. <laughs> Look how pretty that is. So pretty. We use you next. And this person paid $3.99 for shipping. This is headed out to Cindy. Let's see where Cindy lives. I forgot to click into this. So $4.99 for the necklace, $3.99 shipping. And Cindy is in Idaho. I'm using my state abbreviations today. One of my subscribers sent me this and the postage. <laughs> Where did I put the postage? I don't know. The postage is somewhere. I literally, there's only so many things in front of me. When I find it, I'll show it to you. But it says like first class mail, four ounces. So I'm gonna guess this is 3.3 ounces. 2.7 ounces. That's not bad. So we round up to three. And eBay is now defaulting to FedEx for me or UPS. I don't know why. So it just defaulted even though the buyer paid for the postal service, first class mail, which should be like $3. It's showing me FedEx on my screen and it's $20.46. I'm not doing that eBay. Stop showing me that. UPS, nope. USPS. Come on, we can do it. First class mail, $3.18. Purchase and print. And I haven't printed for a few days, so I'll probably have to choose my correct printer. Let's see what it defaults to. Print. Oh, it defaulted to the correct printer. I'm printing on my Dymo 4XL. There we are. Nice four inch by six inch label. Let's put a 
sticker that says happy now. Thank you, Cindy. And I'll be shipping that tomorrow. Let's do, I should just pull one. That's what we usually do. Let's do these next. We have a lot of two. Oh, this is headed to Cindy as well. Is this the same Cindy? Cindy. <laughs> I should check. Oh, Cindy has several things. Oh, that's so funny. Okay, good thing I checked. Too late. Okay. We are going to nicely cut this open. I'm going to avoid the label. Okay, we'll leave that. I think she has too many items for that, so we'll see. Let me go into my shipping labels. So on the My eBay page on the left-hand side, there's a little column, and you can go into shipping labels. It'll pop up a second screen, and under more actions, void. It'll pop up another screen, and I could put problem with label, label lost, label didn't print. You can literally pick anything. I'm going with label didn't print because there's not... Melissa screwed up. Okay, so that voided. I'll get that back in a few days. So let's go back to Cindy. <laughs> okay, so she has two bracelets. I'll have to refund her the additional shipping costs if I haven't already. So these are both wrap style. You really could wear them around your neck probably twice, I'm gonna guess. Yeah, twice at least, um, or your wrist. But I listed them as bracelets. Somebody told me they were probably bracelets. This one is a faux turquoise, and this one is a really pretty color. It's like a purpley blue, like a tanzanite kind of color. Okay, we'll just wrap those around, and we will put them in my aqua box. I get my boxes from, is it JPI? JPI Display. And one of my subscribers told me about that. Thank you so much. They have such pretty boxes. They have gold, they have of course just white, and they have marble, and they have the aqua. They've got bunches. And these were the cheapest by far. And the boxes are a nice quality. They're not, they're not cheap boxes. Okay, let's click out of JPI. And um, let's use the heart tissue paper. Look how fun that is. Oh, so fun. Holding it upside down. Reminds me of Lisa Frank. I don't remember if I ever had one of her trapper keepers, but my mom was very on top of it. We had the good toys. And she really tried to do her best. I remember she got me LA Gear sneakers once. <laughs> this is gonna put me in a bad light. She got me LA Gear sneakers once. I should cut this in half. Um, and I cried because I didn't like them and I wanted my old sneakers. My old sneakers were falling apart. And LA Gear was like all the rage. My mom's like, no, everybody's wearing them. They're really cool. And I wanted no part of them. I'm sorry, mom. I wonder if she remembers that. I just got off the phone with her because today is actually her 60th birthday. She was at Dollar Tree. She was looking for headbands with a wire. They're like a long tube of cloth with a wire that you can bend and like tying a bow above your head. She was also trying to find pool noodles because when she ships breakables, and my mom ships a lot of breakables, I couldn't even imagine. I do not want to do that in the least. <laughs> you see what I'm shipping. I like shipping what I'm shipping. Um, sometimes she uses pool noodles. So she was at the Dollar Tree. Okay, this one I can use the blue pretty ribbon. We'll just tie it around once. Oh my goodness, this is such a good combination. Cutest stuff I have. So anyway, she was she was at Dollar Tree for pool noodles, but she said she's also going to look for those headbands. And I said, do you want me to go on Amazon? Because Amazon has a gajillion. And I said, they're actually pretty trendy. I've seen those a lot in Instagram photos. She just wanted it to keep her hair off her head her forehead <laughs> uh, at the beach. I told her to check Target, because Target sometimes has trendier items. Not that I've been to Target. I really wonder if I've been to Target in two years. I don't think I have. Okay, Cindy, let's see what else you have. You have an Alex and Ani bracelet. I know I pulled this. She usually sell for about three or four dollars. Oh, did I tell you what the wrap bracelets went for? 
They went for $8.99 for the set of two, and this one went for $3.99. It's called the Seven Swords. I thought it was a Christmas tree at first, but it's actually swords, which makes it so much cooler. Let's do a white box. Oh, let's do the, let's do the gold box. Okay. Now this is probably going to bounce around. So let's take a piece of foam. I'm going to fold it up a bit. And then put it inside the box. And that way it doesn't bounce around. There we go. I'll put a little washi tape on. Washi tape will ensure that she can reuse the box if she wants. And just pull that washi tape off and it doesn't hurt anything. Let's do some Jilson Roberts paper. We will be using the floral collage. I use Mr. Gift Wrap. He has a website, but I don't think he has the Jilson Roberts tissue paper on his website yet but you can absolutely call him. His name is Chris, he's awesome. He gets back to you so fast and he's a dad. He's running his own website, so I appreciate supporting him as well. Jilson Roberts doesn't sell to individuals. It's the weirdest thing ever. And not even to somebody like me who goes through literally 2,000 sheets of tissue paper a month which is crazy to me, <laughs> but um, they won't sell to me. I thought about setting up my own website and I have a call in to see if I can do that. And that way I can just buy from myself. They're not, they're not the best about calling back though, I gotta say. They're on Amazon though, you can order from Amazon. Sometimes the newer prints aren't there. So Mr. Gift Wrap is really good for the newer prints. Okay, this one says, for you. Um, let's use the leaves. Oh, that'll be great. Oh, well, they're really pretty. I think I've had these ones before my mom sent me some. She found them at Goodwill. It has a, like a satin sheen to one side. They're so pretty. I cut way too many. That's okay. I'm still saving my ribbon scraps, so they'll go to good use. Okay, there we go. Little ribbon scrap. Huh. Okay, let's see. Let's go into my eBay and make sure this is it. So much fun. Look how fun that little, little tower of packages is. Okay, let's see. Monica, Amy, Jeannie, Christine, Pamela, Courtney, Katie, Virginia, Cindy, Cindy, Sandra, Cindy. Okay, we're good. These are the three. So let's hit print shipping label on one of the other items. I don't think these are gonna fit in this mailer anymore, unfortunately. So we're gonna have to do a poly mailer. I have my own poly mailers printed. I'm working on the design um, because I'm designing them myself. This was just a, a rough draft, but they say you are enough in like a watercolor aqua. So we'll use one of those. I have a few little tweaks to put on the design before I have them printed though. Ooh, the quality is nice though, I have to say. Okay, let's weigh this. I'm gonna say 7.8, 6.4. So we round up to seven. And again, I have to see if I refunded her because she, just the way it is with eBay, the way I have it set up, you have to pay for each item. That just ensures somebody pays. If you don't have that checked in your listing, somebody can buy it and then just never pay. Okay, so let's go to PayPal under view all and type Cindy in there. 
think I refunded her. Okay, here she is. Refund, refund. Yes. So let's go back to eBay. So I did refund her for the additional shipping already, which go me. Okay, FedEx. I don't want FedEx. I don't want UPS. Here we go. First class mail, USPS, $3.67. Purchase and print. So this other mailer, I will just rip off her label, or at least as, as best I can. And that way it doesn't have her dress on. <laughs> My fingers. There we go. Well, that's not going very well. We'll do that later. Pretend that didn't happen. Print and print and print. Good. Now I have to go to my eBay main page and upload the tracking number for the items that I didn't print the tracking label for. You understand. Thanks, Cindy. I'll put a sticker on that a little bit later. Sticker things. Okay, so we're going to find this tracking number, the correct one, and copy it. And then go to her other item and under more actions we can add tracking number paste it in there and save and then i'm going to go to her first item that has this label and i'm going to attach our new tracking number so that was the necklace print another label how do i do this can i do this there's print another label. Can I attach a second tracking number? Hmm. Add tracking. Yes, I can. Okay, so I have to click into order details and then there's add tracking. So the first tracking number is there. So I have to hit add another and paste it. So now it's going to have both tracking, but at least one of them is correct. The other one, it won't even matter. Okay, so let's go to our next item, which is this J. Crew neon orange breast home necklace. Oh, this is going to be so pretty in October. I mean, you could really wear orange almost year round. It's kind of summery and kind of like harvesty. Okay, so let's find who purchased this. This is Courtney. Courtney, did you purchase anything else before I start this? No. Okay, print shipping label. She paid $7. So I have this, I think, listed for $9.99 and it didn't sell for probably a week, week and a half. And so I sent an offer of $7. And she paid $3.99 for shipping. We could do a couple different boxes with this. I have these long necklace boxes, which might work, but because this one is definitely flexible, I think I'm going to put it in like a semi-circle and use this box. I think the boxes cost about the same, so it's not about cost. It's just about presentation. Get in there, little chain. See? It's like a bouquet of flowers. Okay, where is my foam roll? I buy these on eBay. I also have bubble wrap. The foam is nice just to tear. It tears horizontally, horizontally, vertically with the grain. So we're going to do that. I'm going to tear off another sheet. Just put that there with some washi. And then let's do this other half since I have it right here. I can't wait to see my niece again. I haven't seen her since. Well, I haven't seen my sister, brother-in-law, or niece. <laughs> Sorry, everybody else. <laughs> Just my niece. I can't wait to see my sister, of course, and my brother-in-law. But, but definitely my niece. Um, I haven't seen them since October, so it'll be good to see them. They're not staying with me, but they're staying close. Okay, let's use more of the leaves. Love this combination. So 
So tomorrow they'll fly in. They're flying into the Bradenton, Sarasota airport, which is very close. It's within a half hour of the condo and us. So they'll go to the condo. We'll probably see them tomorrow night. There we are. And let's do, let's do this. We'll reuse this. She'll never know. Here we are. We're using the same pearl mask. So obviously I cut this one open, so we're gonna have to tape it shut. Get some of my free eBay tape. Ooh, it's very thick. Oh, I don't wanna use my pinking shears for tape. Have to take care of those. So just for right now, we're going to just tape it like that. And then we'll tape a little bit more securely. Now, obviously, I have to cover this label. Come on. If you hit your Dymo, the blue button at the front, it'll just spit out a blank label. So I'm going to put that over there. Get all this out. And I'm going to say, this feels heavy. Four ounces. Oh, I have to wait for it. 5.2, I was low. So we round up to six. And again, she paid seven for the necklace, $3.99 for shipping, and my cost is $3.31. eBay got with the program. They're like, we see you don't want to use a $20 service. Okay, print. And print. And print. It is gorgeous here. Probably been in the upper, oh, somebody text me. Ah, my sister sent me something. Well, we'll check later. Um, it's been in the upper 80s, I would say. Let's see what it says now, 88. So it should be nice for my mom and sister, brother-in-law and niece. Thank you, Courtney. Yeah, that's nice and secure now. And let's pull out our next item. I have a whole bunch of extra bags in here. We are going to do these Nordstrom rhinestone earring studs. Rhinestone earring studs. Did I say that right? I don't know. They retail for $29. And they sold probably within a week or two for $7. Again, I probably listed them for $9.99 and sent somebody an offer. They are headed to Pamela in Alabama. Did I say where Courtney lived? Courtney's in Texas. Okay, so Pamela in Alabama. Let's put these in a box. So pretty. Just a little bit of foam to protect them. And a little bit of foam to wrap around the box to hold it nice and secure. That way the top doesn't come off. Don't want to lose your top. Let's do some hearts. Oh, it's a very long piece. We'll use it doubled. This has like a crinkly feel to it. Like it, like it. There we are. Oh, just lost part of my washi. Oh no. Did I bring more washi? I did. I have one that says, hello, summer. Let's pretend it's still summer. It's still summer here. Okay. I haven't been to the beach in weeks just because of everything that's been happening around here. So try to get to the beach at least once with my mom and sister and everybody else. Let's use this vintage pink gingham. I purchased a lot of, a lot, a lot of ribbon on eBay. And this was one of these spools. 
I want to make sure I have enough to go around twice. And they were local, so they, they came to my house to deliver it, which surprised me because I didn't realize they were going to do that. My security camera sent me a notification. Somebody crossed its path. I don't know how I set that up, but I did. And I thought it was just Amazon or something. And no, it's the people delivering four huge boxes of ribbon, which I'm so glad they were able to deliver it because it would have cost a fortune. Okay, let's do that and that. We'll see if this little piece, this little piece is almost non-existent. I'll throw that one away. So business card, business card. And a sheet mask. Pretty pink ribbon. Since it has the pink ribbon, we'll use the pink hollow, not hollow, metallic. Metallic is the word I'm looking for. Mailer. And how much did Pamela pay? Pam paid $2.99. I'm gonna guess three ounces. 2.7, ooh. That'd be a good party trick, except I don't go to parties. Okay, UPS is $14. <laughs> Click USPS, it is $2.78. Purchase and print. Clean up a little bit here. Put a sticker on that while that's printing. Print. 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 And, and you way over here get a sticker. Okay. Yeah, it's blue skies with those big puppy clouds, cumulus clouds. Somehow I remembered clouds. Nimbus, cumulus, cirrus, rhombus. That's not a cloud. Okay, next, let's do this bracelet. Who purchased you? Virginia. And Virginia is in, I feel like I, I know Virginia, Texas. Sterling silver, I have sterling silver cleaner I bought on Amazon. I was using the wipes, which I loved, but they were pricey. So I purchased some and silver. Let's just type in silver. Nope, that's just bringing up everything. Oh, here it is, okay. Brilliant eight ounce silver jewelry cleaner with cleaning basket. I didn't even know it had a cleaning basket. $7.95 shipped on Prime. It works so well. And there's, it's, it's probably this big. Um, it'll be even better now that I know it has the basket. It's got one purple bead and has this really pretty hook. I think I'm gonna go with one of the smaller boxes and wrap this around. That way the bead shows. And more foam. Just a little piece. It's such a nice thing to have a really good cleaner. I love that cleaner. Seriously, plus the sterling silver cleaner is like magic. Like you could put something completely, now I know I can even drop it in. Oh my goodness, that made it so much better. It just completely changes it. It takes it from like this dirty patina silver to a nice shiny silver. Let's do the birds. Big hummingbirds. I have never seen a hummingbird. I don't know if that's true. I think I've seen a hummingbird, not here in Florida. Maybe when I was growing up on Long Island, my mom had a hummingbird feeder, or somebody did, I feel like. I know I've seen a feeder. I don't know if I've actually seen a hummingbird. <laughs> Two different things. My sister would remember. She remembers everything. We doubled it over. Oh, the purple is so pretty. It's like an indigo purple. 
Still can't use that washing until I peel that off. Last time I was at the beach, it was just after a storm. It was after the hurricane hit Louisiana, or it was like at least passing Florida. And it wasn't too stormy while we were there, but um, it was enough of a storm to bring in some seashells. So I collected a whole bunch of seashells. Okay, we'll use the gingham. <laughs> I didn't wanna, wanna participate. Let's put on the business cards first. See if that helps. I don't know if that's gonna work. Let's see. With with wide ribbon like this and a smaller package, it's like the whole package is just now ribbon. Ooh, that might have been the perfect length of ribbon. We'll see. Oh, that was so good. You can barely see the tissue, it's like right there. <laughs> okay, so she paid $15.50 and that tells me I sent an offer. I don't know why I sent an offer of $15.50. Usually I do whole numbers um, and not like 50. Uh, and $3.99 for shipping. She is one of these since it's smaller. Those slightly bigger boxes won't fit in these aqua mailers. Weigh it 3.5, 2.8, 3. And UPS is $15. It shows me every time now. And she paid $3.99. My cost was $2.84. Purchase and print. Clean up a little bit while that's thinking. Print and print, print and print. My husband was up a little bit later. He's normally up until like three, four o'clock. That's just him. And he decided to repaint our desk. I was like, can you just magic erase the desk? Sometimes um, I can't press hard enough to get out like the little things. Thank you, Virginia. Put a sticker on here. It's a little envelope, a little polka dot envelope. And he's like, I just decided to repaint it. Okay. Let's do this one. This is falling out of the bag. This is a Kendra Scott rare, ooh, rare, uh, golden gold. Nemera, is that how we pronounce that? N-E-M-E-R-A. I thought it was, okay. It's pretty long. You could wear it doubled, of course, but yeah, that's very long. And um, this sold for $39. I think I had this for $49.99 and I sent an offer for $39. It is headed to Katie. Hi, Katie, in Georgia. She paid $3.99 shipping. So we're gonna use a small box and I'll tell you why. With these longer necklaces, I love going around this little thing and how it like, you'll just have to see. We'll see if I, yeah, I think it works. There we go. And that way, most likely won't get tangled. This is a fairly thick gauge of chain too. Here, oh, let me put it in the box. Yes, that's better. I just like the presentation of it, like multi-layer. Can we see that without dumping? Did I use all my stuff? A little bit of foam. This is the marble box. So our house is pretty much clean. Again, they're not staying with us. Honestly, our house is pretty much clean <laughs> all the time, but it's like extra clean. Just in case somebody lays on the floor and looks underneath our countertops, they're clean. Oh, actually 
that could happen. Last time my niece was here, and one of our neighbors, Jason, who I'm sure you've heard me talk about, he's now eight, they were playing hide and seek with me in the house. I cannot believe some of the places we got into. We have this really tiny closet that's just hanging out in the living room corner and we keep our file cabinet in it. And the file cabinet is almost the exact same as the closet. And I was in there, my niece came and hid with me in this closet that has to be like, I don't know, less than two feet. We were cracking up. So much fun. I have some crafts just in case they want to do crafts. Hobby Lobby had some crafts on sale. And my husband, um, what were we looking for? Oh, my husband wants pink sneakers, New Balance pink sneakers. But he's almost an impossible size for pink sneakers. He's a 13 4E, which is like extra, extra, extra wide, big sneakers. I should have put the business cards on first. So I'm like, why don't we buy some pink fabric paint and I can just like go over the end with pink fabric paint. So that's why we're right there. Again, the bow overtakes it. Look how fun that little bow is though. We found the pink paint and then we looked at craft supplies and I found, I found some soap. It's called Squishy Soap Craft. It was only $6.11 for the whole kit. That was too good to pass up. My sister said she wanted something clean and no slime. So squishy soap, we're good. 3.3, oh, I forgot to guess. I guess 3.3. Rounds up to four. And USPS first class is $2.78. Purchase and print. And Jason doesn't know she's coming, our neighbor who's eight. Uh, we told his mom and she's like, I'm going to keep it a surprise. So he doesn't know. And my niece knows that he doesn't know. So she's planning this big surprise for him. I don't know what it is yet, but she's so excited. They had so much fun last time they were together, even with the two year age difference. Thanks so much, Katie. They were just like running around the community because we live on a dead end in a really nice private community. It's not like over the top wealthy community. It's just really pretty back here. Next, we have something that sold within minutes. I always feel like, did I price that too low? And then honestly, I just move on. And I'm like, oh, that, that's good, who cares? It's this. Guess how much I got for this. I got $49.99. It's real gold, it's 14 karat gold a little bit of cotton from the box. I don't know if I'll be able to show it to you. Such a dainty chain with little beads on it. So I really want to make sure this arrives safe. How am I going to do that? Did I use the long box? Long box, where did you go? Oh, here it is. Maybe the long box. I was just storing it in this one. Usually I store things in plastic bags, as you know but I didn't want it to tangle. Can I put it around this? Such a tiny closure. Here we go, I got it, ha, huh, that was fast. Okay, let's see. Let's see if this wants to work with me. It might. Oh, satisfying 10 out of 10. That was perfect, perfect. Now we are going to put some foam on top. So this sold really fast. It was one point something something, 1.9 grams, but that's the total weight. And it had a few beads. So um, that wasn't like full gold. Gold was probably over, definitely over an ounce though. Maybe even, how am I gonna do that? That was not the appropriate size. Um, Maybe even like 1.5 ounces. And I looked up gold when I priced it. It's going to Jeannie. Jeannie, I love the second name you have on here. And I don't want to say it, but if you want to say it in the comments, it's a good name. I wonder if that's your store name. Do 
you sell? How can I figure that out? I think I have to go to eBay. Love a good store name. Okay, let's see. Here we go. Let's see if she sells. I'm going to say she does. She does. She sells jewelry. Oh my goodness. So pretty. Oh, and some of her titles have video. Should I be videoing things? What does she mean video? She has a YouTube channel. Oh, I hope it's going to be okay to say her name. Come say your name. I don't want to say it just in case it's private or she's buying this privately. <laughs> we will put it in the flowers since that's right there. And she is in Virginia. I told you nothing else. And she paid for, I told you this, $49.99 with $3.99 shipping. I was being too loud. Cut this in half. I ordered the papers. I have so many tissue papers. Again, I got through a lot of tissue though. I ordered the Halloween prints. I already had Thanksgiving and Christmas picked out. But I got it in my head that I wanted a different theme that I originally planned for October. So it's on the way. With my Patreon, like I said, I'm putting together almost 100 boxes. And by boxes, I mean packages, the chips and poly mailers. Keep the cost down. And I try to do themes. Sometimes it works out and sometimes not. So we'll see. I think I can do the theme for October though. I always like to put something together that is seasonal, but you can use any time of year in case you don't sell that many items. Oh, the pink is really pretty too. Okay, we'll go with the green. I guess we'll just pull off a new loop. This is gonna get messy very quickly. That's okay, you're worth it. I filmed, what was that? I filmed a thread up box opening where I opened three boxes of jewelry and I know I filmed it. I specifically remember sitting and filming it and I filmed it over two days with my camera and I went to look at the footage. There was no footage. So I don't know if I deleted it or my camera, it wasn't just like one take, it was, hours of footage over multiple days. So didn't have to edit that video. That gold necklace, this gold necklace was in there though. There we are. Now this is a bigger box obviously, so I'm going to have to put this in a poly mailer. And we have a bunch of them that a subscriber sent. I've never seen this one. This one has birds. Those roses, cabbage blooms. I don't know flowers. Oh, it's so pretty. There are so many good poly mailers nowadays. I feel like 20 years ago there were no, there were white poly mailers. Oh. Okay, I'll be back. It is about, I don't know, maybe an hour longer, <laughs> uh, an hour. Hey, it's about an hour from when I filmed. If you don't like to hear anything negative, this is going to be a very short thing. I, I don't think this is going to trigger anybody, but I got a message as um, an Amber alert. So I always, if I have the time, which I absolutely do 99% of the time, I always like to go find the situation. I'm not out and about, but I can text my husband and you know, as he's driving or we can just keep our eyes and ears open. So back to the gold necklace. It is, what is this way? <laughs> I still didn't clip it in. And then I took some more medication and ate some almonds. 2.8, so we round up to three. My husband picked me up almonds. I'm constantly looking for other foods that just don't make me sick. 
Okay, so UPS is 15. What is first class is $2.84. She paid $3.99. Now this is a little bit of a pricey item and first class mail does not have insurance. So if this gets lost, I would have to refund her the $49.99 plus a $3.99. Let's see. I can add insurance for, I believe, $1.70. Yes, for $1.70. So if you just scroll down, I use my mouse roller thing. If you still have a mouse, I do. Um, you can choose that option. Option. So I am gonna do that. So that bumps it up to $4.54. Purchase and print. Just never know with the USPS at this point. Most of my packages have been getting to <laughs> the buyers quickly, but you just never know. Print and print. So if this goes missing now, it's at least insured and I can start the claim with the USPS. Thank you so much, Jeannie. And again, if you're watching, please leave your store below because you have really pretty things. Okay takes me a little bit to get back into the swing of things here. I listed this and it sold again within a few minutes, maybe an hour at the most. It is Trafari. I know that's a vintage. I think they still make jewelry. It's really pretty. It's really pretty. It is a shiny gold, obviously. And then there's a red stone. Um, just kind of looks like half a marble. And then some blue and green stones. They're, they feel, they don't feel like real stone, but honestly, they'd have to feel really like a stone for me to say that. So this sold for $39, nope, $34.99. And it is headed to a very odd address. This makes me think it's being sent overseas by one of those services that picks up for you and then... I think this is one of those services. So somebody overseas, I could be wrong, um, just by the way the address is structured, and it's a suite and it has other information in Oregon. It looks like somebody probably went to their website and purchased this, and then it's going to go to a country I don't ship to. So let's see. A square box might work for this. I don't know if a long box We'll, we'll try, we'll try. Yeah, I think the square box will work just fine. I'm gonna kind of wrap it around a little bit. There we go. And foam. And um, what did they pay for shipping? Did I say that? $34.99 for the necklace and $3.99 for shipping. says hello oh. hello let's do what other papers did I bring over I don't know if I brought over any more I have this giant bag full of stuff oh I did I did bring over some more let's do this paper I think this is called bloom this was the first Jilson Roberts print that I ever purchased from Amazon it's not this exact pack. I've purchased it since then. But this was this was what changed my shipping forever. There we are. So I don't know if I know this person's name or if this is just a business but it is headed to, at least I have to get it to Oregon. I've only been to Oregon once and it was a company, my husband, I do not need that, let's focus. A company my husband and I worked for sent us out there for some training. Oh, that's it. <laughs> so let's just do once around. Oh, 
but because we didn't have a car and we were like on tour buses and stuff, it's a pretty big company. Um, and it was like their main training center. We didn't really get to explore. We were mostly in meetings, but fun meetings. I, I thought, <laughs> I'm sure my husband <laughs> would have different opinion. Let me save that little piece. Okay. So overseas with sheet masks, I don't know about that. Do I have tissues in here? I do. I'm gonna do tissues as the package topper. Sometimes um, just different countries won't allow things. And since I'm pretty sure this is going to a different country, I'm going to include tissues because that has less of a chance of being pulled. We will use the fish mallard. ounces we round up and my cost is going to be 318 purchase and print I didn't do insurance on that one since I, I'm pretty sure it'll get there maybe I should have I don't know normally I don't really do insurance just with all those packages that went missing in June which still missing I've seen the gentleman who's picked them up three times now. Um, but again, it's been months, so I'm, I just let it go. Thank you so much to that person. Okay, we have a lot of bags. I have bag bags. Let's pull the things. get saved and reused. So we will do the earrings next because a lot of these items are together. The earrings are going to Christine. Hi Christine. I recognize her. And these are Kendra Scott. Are they Ellie's? What were these called? Ellie. That's just the style. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. It's like they're hexagonal. Is that a word? We'll put it in a small box. Let's do the marble one. I could, I could. Somewhere in this, I have, oh, we have this fun yellow box too. I thought I had it. Yeah, here it is. I have these um, inserts. I don't know what to call them but you can stick earrings through them. So I'm gonna do that. Then we might have to cut off the bottom because I don't know if it's gonna fit in the box, but at least the presentation's pretty. Okay, so let's cut off the bottom. We'll round the corners a little. They don't look professionally rounded, but I'm trying. That's not bad. We'll save that piece. Okay, so here's what they look like now. They have Druzy. Let's use the, the cherry yellow box somebody sent me. And some foam. already says thank you on it. Somebody put the sticker for me. Thank you. Maybe we'll use some washi. And then I guess we'll just use this piece since I cut it in half. So these are headed to Christine. Christine's MI. For the first time ever, I get to use this. And MI is Michigan. Love that. Oh, they also have them alphabetical. Oh, 
by state and by initial. So smart. Do you make these? Did you make that? Do you have those available for sale somewhere? I would like to know. So helpful. Didn't have to stop and Google it. Okay, here we are. So this should be to her. I'm going to not do a package pickup. I haven't been using package pickup all that much since June, just because um, they lost 19 packages from eBay and then Patreon packages as well. So I've been dropping them off or honestly having my husband drop them off. <laughs> I don't think I dropped them off once. I've been along though um, at the post office that's in a gas station and those people love packages. They said they get a quarter per package that they scan. So they're always pretty excited to see us. And tomorrow we're going to the condo to put some items um, in the condo before my mom and everybody gets here. Just some things that we have that we think they'll want. My mom also has her beach chairs and umbrella here. We store them for her. And a mask. And let's go nautical. We will use one of these navy blue anchor. This has a little bit of navy in it, so it doesn't have to match though. This company, Polly Mailers, are like a little bit staticky. I didn't realize that. I probably won't purchase them yet. Okay. Still good though. This is light. 2.1. No way! It's 2.1! Not to show you. It's exactly 2.1. We knew I had to be right on it sooner or later. So we round up to three. And she paid $29 for the earrings and $3.29 for shipping. So UPS is $15. USPS, the post office, is $2.93. Purchase and print. And print. And print. And print. I think we have two more packages, but one of them has four items. Thank you, Christine. Oh, it's good to see you. So we'll do the scrap metal first. I had some scrap sterling. It has marks, but it has issues like the brick. It has 925 on it. Like this earring doesn't have the thing in the top. They just had some issues. There was a lot of dirt. I did dip them in the thing, but that's just because I like doing that now. It's fun. So I'm going to just put these in a box and we'll do this. And this sold pretty immediately as well, um, a couple hours. So this is headed to Monica. And it sold for $9.99. I might be able to get like a dollar or two more if I waited, but honestly, I just like to sell things fairly quickly. Monica is also in Georgia. And let's wrap this up. In this, since it's already cut. I don't know if she'll redesign it or just fix it and wear it. The bracelet's in really good shape. I mean, other than having a little bit of a patina, but it's definitely wearable. And the earring, you would just need to replace that little top piece. I think I even brought those to the pawn shop, but for what they wanted to give me for them, um, I said I would just sell it, and I did. We'll do the chiffon blue. 
I did get 1300 something from a jeweler. We brought our scrap gold and silver to a jewelry store. That was my mom's suggestion. Excuse me, that was my mom's suggestion. And we did pretty well with it. And then we went to a pawn shop for the silver. And they bought like 12 or $14. The funny thing is um, you have to, if you sell to a jewelry shop or a pawn shop, you have to get your fingerprint done and you're in the police system for 30 days. And I think I was more excited about that than anything. <laughs> I was like, really? Okay. There we are. Put a mask in. And let's do one of these tropical leaves. I know what this is called in my head. <laughs> Some kind of leaf that starts with an M. I've, I've seen the word before. I don't know how to pronounce it. But like fern, tropical leaves. I think we actually have this plant right outside. Yep. We have this, this one, the big leafy M word plant. 3.9. So we round up to three. And she paid $3.99 shipping and then $9.99 for the items. My cost is $2.78. Purchase and print. Thinking, thinking, thinking. There we are. Print and print. <laughs> I think that brings us to the last set of items. Now I have closed my shop and I'll keep it closed for the next week. Thank you, Monica. And then just depending on my husband's surgery, um, I'll open it or not. That's kind of the nice thing about eBay, that it kind of works around my schedule. All right, so we have four items headed to Sandra. Hi, Sandra. We have the PD, which is Premier Designs. The shine on this is phenomenal. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it's got rhinestones. It's so pretty in person. It has like those rhinestones with the coating that catches the light and it's like all iridescent shimmery. So pretty. Let's do it in this one. And yeah, we'll go around that way. Good. And then she purchased a faux turquoise and silver tone ring. Oh, I should tell you prices. The ring went for $6.99. The gorgeous bracelet by Premier Designs went for $9.99. So we're going to put this ring in the same box, but we're going to separate it with foam so it doesn't squish against the um, bracelet. Then we have two necklaces. These might get their own boxes, we'll see. This one is by Lucky. It's a ball chain. <laughs> there we go. I was gonna say, it can't possibly be tangled. It's such a, a big gauge, but sure enough, it did tangle. Oh, this part tangled too? Okay, there we go, fell out. It didn't, it didn't fall out, I was wrong. Seriously. Okay, there we are. It is a double layer. The top one has a little curved kind of smiley face bar. And then there's a faux turquoise and then a dangle with like, um, you're not gonna be able to see it, but a little oval in silver. So, this went for $8.99, and then the next necklace I will show you went for $3.99. So let's see, how are we going to do this? Will that work? <laughs> I think that'll work. Okay, that's gonna work. We're going to put it in its own box though, so. The other one won't get tangled. Stay. 
stuff that in there so it doesn't go anywhere. And then the last item, I'm so glad I listed this. I wasn't sure. It was pretty though. I just kind of go with my gut. If something is going to bring a few dollars, I, I'm a fairly fast lister and I take photographs pretty quickly and sitting down. So this might have taken me less than a minute to photograph, probably about a minute to list, and now shipping it would be just maybe two minutes to ship it, but I'm on camera and talking. It's silver tone and it has all these really pretty shimmery little discs that catch the light. It's really pretty. Okay, so let's put this in this tiny box and let's wrap it around. so it doesn't get tangled and then we'll put it back in the box there we go little piece of foam yesterday my husband um, was at the studio studio recording studio yes <laughs> suddenly it sounded wrong and uh, it went through lunchtime so they all got pizza it's not like I can eat pizza, but they got pizza. So I, I hope I hope they get something today because it's 2.30. Okay, and then this one, again, this is just to hold these box tops on. So it doesn't have to be the exact length as long as it puts some pressure. Good pressure. This one goes this way, this one goes that way. Okay, let's do you, let's start with the hearts. Get a half piece of hearts out. That might even be enough for two items. Bananas. The bananas were in my August Patreon package. The theme was actually bananas. There we are. So, who's going in the bananas? Let's do the big one in the bananas. Will you fit? You'll fit this way. Such a hot pink banana background. So pretty. I'm always happy to see Jilson Roberts do something like this because florals are pretty, wood greens and polka dots and stripes are pretty, but bananas, who would have thought bananas? Okay, and then we will cut this one in half and use it for the two smaller boxes. And then, unfortunately, oh, oh, that'll be really pretty. I don't want to use them up. One of my subscribers sent me these gorgeous cards, and I want to keep them forever. <laughs> there's, there's a bunch of them. I keep looking at them, though, and I'm like, I should share these with people. Can I just put them in frames, though? They're so pretty. <laughs> I'm going to change the battery on my camera and I'll be back. These hearts, whoever makes this tissue, just makes me so, I have like a little bubble of joy inside. Have you seen the artists putting together polymer clay earrings and beads? Oh my goodness. So addicting to watch them on YouTube make like their scrap pile into earrings and marbleize and texture. Oh, it's so pretty. If you haven't watched that yet, you are missing out. Let me tell you. <laughs> so fun. This is such a little one. I think I can fold this in half even. Yeah. I already have my mom's birthday gifts wrapped up. And I went with uh, the zebras, which is a Jelson Robert 
gift wrap. I think they sold out of it. I got a really good deal on it ages ago, like last year. And some vintage purple ribbon. And I don't know if we're doing that. I should message my sister and ask if we're doing gifts at my house or at their condo. Because that'd be something I need to know before tomorrow. If, along with all the other stuff we're dropping off, I need to leave the gifts there. We bought her, so my aunt chipped in as well, and my, my sister and I, and it's her 60th birthday. We bought her, I can tell you, um, a blue salt wrap. Blue salt is a higher end company that makes like luxuriously soft athleisure wear. So we got her their two yard wrap. It looks like a, a throw blanket, honestly, but it feels ridiculously soft. And I, I make little notes up on the backs of them and I like number them so she knows which order to go in. I think I'm gonna stick with the blue for all three because that even has blue in it. I put on that card to put around you when you're at your computer or something like that. We got her that wrap. We got her um, the Lometric digital, it's, it's a clock, but it also has like apps you can put on it. So one of the apps is something where you can count down your subscribers. So she'd love to hit 100,000 subscribers on, on YouTube. And so she can put that on. <laughs> it's so difficult. Maybe I'll try to pop in a photo. Um, but it kind of looks like, like just a screen and then you can make it say the weather or your calls. It's like a mini tablet with apps. I don't know how better to describe that, but it's pricey. <laughs> so if you're thinking it's not, it is. And then what else did we get her? We got her two more things. Oh, uh, a bag, a custom like burlap bag that says her YouTube catchphrase, go out and get what's yours. And then a, this is gonna be a funny thing. <laughs> Just gonna have no idea what to do with it until I explain it. A mini crimper. And she says her hair sometimes goes flat. So what you do is you lift up some and like crimp it. It's a very tiny crimp at the, and then you put it back down and your hair has volume for the whole day. So that wasn't very pricey at all. And I think that's it. That's it, like like those four gifts weren't enough. But again, because we got money from multiple places. I think we're good. Let's do, let's do the purple. Oh, let's do the pink. Sorry, purple, you were almost used. That's fun. Look at that, sprinkles. Bananas and hearts and sprinkles. Okay, so this is going to Sandra. Let's hit print shipping label. And I already refunded her since she purchased the four items separately. That's just how you have to do it with eBay and my store. The sticker says, you have great taste. And so she probably paid, well, she paid $13.46, but I refunded most of that. So. She probably paid like $3.99 or four something. It's 5.3. I forgot to count it again. So I round up to six. And first class mail is $3.39. Purchase and pay. You have a few little scraps. I'll put them in my scrap bag. Print. And print. Oh, I'm so glad I finished up before my husband comes back. Not that it matters, he doesn't care, but that way I'll just get to see him and interact and ask how it was. Thank you so much, Sandra. So I think that's it. Let's make sure everybody has stickers. This one says, treat yourself. I have never said that in real life. This one needs a sticker. This one says happy mail. Sticker on this one. You deserve this. Wow, I'm a 
just a lot of stickers. Again, happy mail, but in a different font. I guess we'll go here with that. You have one, you need one. You've got great taste. We've come full circle. And I think everybody else has one. So I will put these in a bag and on the way to the condo tomorrow morning to drop off all of the goodies for my family. We will drop those off at the post office. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you're doing well. Take care, stay safe. Bye. your day is blooming with joy